this week, I need to address some comments regarding Dr. Vaughn's video on blackhead removal. Let me take care of the easy one first, okay? We got a guy who calls himself Keyed Up. I don't know about Keyed Up. In my opinion, he's another kind of up if you get my meaning. Anyway, he says, you're kind of garbage at this shit, bruh. Okay, I got this for you. Dr. Vaughn says it would be unprofessional to show you what I got. So we came up with this compromise. So you can just take a spin on this, bruh. Next, we've got a woman who calls herself Perry. This one might actually be our old friend Donna, working under another name. People actually do that, you know. She asks, why does a supposed professional group need to steal another doctor's videos? All of the videos in this playlist are stolen from Dr. Sandra Lee, reported. Wow, look at all those caps and exclamation points. She is really worked up. And who is she reporting this to? The internet police? Can we expect to be arrested? Frankly, I'm getting a little nervous. In a separate comment, on the very same day, she says, I see all these people saying, people are stealing your videos, but you stole Dr. Sandra Lee's videos. Why does a professional group feel the need to steal another doctor's work. Talk about unprofessional. More caps and even more exclamation points. I'm beginning to think this is getting pretty serious. Then, in a third comment on the very same day, she goes all out. Are you really that stupid? Sorry, I rarely say things like that, but for pity's sake, you stole this video. You stole it from Dr. Sandra Lee. Now we've got caps and exclamation points and 12 12 asterisks. That's taken off the gloves for sure. Which, by the way, was something Dr. Vaughn would not let me do for our bruh, Mr. Keyed Up. Perry, what do you mean I rarely say things like that? This is the third comment on the same day in case you weren't counting. But please allow me to mansplain how this works. What you did was play Dr. Vaughn's Blackhead playlist, which starts with his Blackhead video, and then continues to play several of Dr. Sandra Lee's videos. These are actually playing off to Dr. Sandra Lee's channel. The playlist is just directing the YouTube player to pre-selected videos. Dr. Lee still gets credit with the views. If there's any advertising, that also would be credited to her. Anyone can make a playlist of any video on YouTube and have it on their channel for people to play. And when I say anyone, I mean anyone, even you. <laughs> As a matter of fact, I paid a visit to your YouTube channel where you yourself have a set of playlists of videos. I noticed you had videos from One Direction, Carol King, Barbara Streisand. You steal those? Should I report you? Maybe I should report you. Because at least one of your playlists exceeds the maximum number of cat videos permitted by people who aren't nuts. I further notice that your channel includes the following information about you. I do not engage in adolescent conversation. People who can only hurl insults, foul language, and name calling are immediately blocked. I will not dignify such behavior with comments of any kind. I do not engage in conversation with trolls. <laughs> but apparently you do troll other people's channels and accuse them of stealing while using lots of caps and asterisks and an overdose of exclamation points. You'll notice, Perry, we don't show you a complete identity on this response. That's mostly because I don't want to send viewers to your channel and risk the possibility that your subscriber base will grow beyond nine. That's it. My work here is done. 